Can you help us understand a little bit more around those underlying mechanisms by which chronic pancreatitis can lead to the development of diabetes. If you look at the studies that are done right now, the, the, the prevalence or how frequently an individual with chronic pancreatitis will get diabetes is wildly different depending on the study. But we do think that anywhere between, you know, a quarter, one out of every four to three out of every four individuals with chronic pancreatitis is going to develop diabetes at some point in their life. If you have a genetic, uh, a very strong genetic factor that um, is probably on the order of about 75% risk long term.